Hey, uh, this is Pokeball35, and welcome back to Poke Park Wii Pikachu's Adventure. Last time, we convinced Venusaur that having friends is good, and then we've made friends. And I also, on the topic of making friends, said I was gonna do this. Uh, get the rainbow thing next to all the currently available friend people. Uh, but then I went and did Leafeon's thing again, and, uh, Leafeon was way too fast. And I was there for like 10 minutes, and I'm like, is it really worth it to do this on this really old game? Just try and get 100%? Like, my current mindset for the last few years with playing games has been like, get everything done as, like, as much as possible. But I'm like, do I really have to? So now we're gonna go to the meeting place, which I do believe is this way. We unlocked it last time, but I did not go there because I was making friends. I wanna go to the meeting place. Oh, hello, big tree. Big dead tree. Doesn't seem very safe to climb up. I got a Drifblum and a Mischievous and a gate. Ah, I heard that you solve all the problems in the Metal Zone. You're quite a celebrity. Oh, I have something to tell you. I gave your friend Chikorita a Poke Park Pad too. This is your first visit to the meeting place, right? Let me play some useful things about it. Meeting place is located in the middle of the Poke Park. You five gates, you can go to various other zones. It's also a place where you'll see Pokemon from other zones. Why not go and say hi? Hi looks weird in this font. To Drifblem, Mistrevis, and Electabuzz. They'll be helping you from now on. Okay, bye. So here's a meeting place, and then I'm gonna get stopped again by Chikorita. Chantut gave me a Poke Park pad. He said names get recorded in it. Not just any names, but the names of all my friends, I, all the friends I make. I'm not much good at skill games, but I've thought of an idea. Look at this huge tree. Looks like it's half unfinished treehouse. Ooh, I'll well finish building it when you invite people here. Cool. Well, we get a big old treehouse. Uh, cause right now it does not look very safe to climb up. Oh, you can't even climb up it at all. That's the thing. When he said it was half unfinished, that was entirely true. Oh, well, Baneri's here. I see that we can play an attraction in the Meadow Zone. My sister must have been visiting there. Oh, they're two different Baneri's, but you can't tell because Baneri all look the same. That's not a racist statement, I swear. Hello? Hi, you've been helping us. Wait. Hi, you've been helping us, haven't you? I've heard lots about you. You freed the Meadow Zone, and now I can go back to work. Thanks. From now on, you can check Drifblin stops in each zone. I have a picture of a berry. When you do, one of us will come and get you. You can quickly go to other zones in exchange for berries. The Meadow Zone is already already has a friend of mine there, so there's no need to check its Drifblin yeah. drift stop. 20 yeah. berries to go to a place. I'm um, good for now. Yeah. Uh, there's a Granny Dose. I think that's his, that's his voice, right? Granny Dose. As I run into Granny Dose. Granny Dose. Granny Dose. gate. Okay. We got these stupid hoppity hippity hops that I hate. And there's also Mistrevis. Mistrevis. See, it is Mistrevis, not Mistrevis, like people, other people say. Welcome, this is the photo studio. You know how to take photos? Take a photo. Press minus and you can take a photo. There are two ways photos. One is a screenshot by pressing minus. I'll include Pikachu in the photo. Take photos this way and you'll see photos of your friends. You can also take a screenshot by pressing B. Oh, it saves it to your, to your SD card. Gotcha. And you, okay, well I have an SD card. I'm not gonna... Do that. You've seen film. Well, I could just press minus. Uh, sure. Nice. I hate that it has the Pokemon Nintendo watermark on the bottom. It's kind of lame. And we also got Electabuzz here. Ew. 
Leave it. Leave it to me if you want to become stronger. Give me berries and I'll power up your thunderbolt. My friends are coming to the meeting place soon. And they have their own strength that will train you to promise. Blah, blah, blah. Bippity, boppity, boo. You can train in the meeting place. You get better at skill games. Power ups. For those type moves, I'm the Pokemon to power you up. Uh, I'm not using berries on anything else right now. There, did you get it? Now I can just... That's a big old thunderbolt. Okay. Oh, uh, well, it's Quarty Fish. That's right, that's a different voice. It's Quarty Fish! Hey, hey, welcome to our visitors. I'm not doing voices for everyone, I'm sorry. They came to the beach zone from the meadow zone and cavern. I hope they come back. Uh, I wanna... I wanna go in there. Oh, sure game. I had to talk to Mystery of Us a second time, and then Corfish has something to say. A message from me, Sora from Polion. Normally, I'd never let anyone pass through this gate. Those are the rules. But I'm worried about Empoleon too. I'll treat this as a special case. On you go. Please take care of Empoleon. I'm gonna be wandering around for three minutes trying to figure out what to do, but all I had to do was talk to the same NPC twice for some reason. Beach Cave? This isn't Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Funky tunes. Yo, I'm jamming out right now. The fight between Gyarados and Frelligator was epic. Whoa. No. Almost as all all the bridges that connected the islands got broken. Gyarados and Frelligator used to be good friends. I wonder where they had a fight. Do you know? Tell me. No. The ground is sh sh shaking. Oh, that scared me so much. Are you sure about that? Because you're still standing in place, hopping on your tail like nothing happened. I thought that it was those two fighting again. I guess it wasn't them, though. I wonder what that was. I haven't seen he you here before. Welcome to the beat zone. No. I haven't had a visitor for a long time. What's that? Oh, I see. You came to the beach zone to see Empoleon. You'll need to cross the ocean from here to reach the iceberg zone. It's too far for you to swim. You should ask Lapras to take you. Lapras often comes to the cape across that bridge. Uh, I do not want to get in the vicinity of Chatot because he's going to give me tutorials and I don't like tutorials. When the ground sugar calls the rock to block the way to Lapras Cape. Or how, how do you know that? I wonder if Lapras is okay. Let's play chase. Wow! Yo, he's a hoppy boy. Get bopped! I, think, I always think Azuril is a funny looking Pokemon because its tail is as big as its entire body. I'll tell everybody that there's a new friend in the beach zone. That's how he sounds like, right? I think that's how he sounds like. He's like... <laughs> Something like that. Ooh, that's a funny noise. No, I hope that Gyarados and Feraligator will be friends again. Oh, I get it. You want to play Chase. Uh... 
chase against the slowpoke. Wow, it was really difficult. No, hmm, you're fast. Let's be friends. It's fun to play with you. Maybe the fun we have here will encourage others to join in. Mudkip! Bunch of good mons showing up. We also got a weasel. Also got wood. Pause. Hello, weasel. Wait, wait. Wait, Hey, to play Gyarados is attractive on the other island, you have to be able to swim. I got something to tell you. Gyarados is acting tough lately. He thinks he's the boss now that Empoleon is not around. You want to play a skill game? You can play Chase. Weasel, don't run back in my direction. Where are you going? The Psyduck's going to get in the way. There's also a course to look. You are dead. Oh no, I lost. We had fun. I'll practice running. It will be easy next time. To beat me next time. My brother Folks will be here soon. He loves Gyarados as attraction. He's fast. His record is awesome. I want to be like him. But you can once you hit a specific level that I can't remember off the top of my head. There's Floatzel. Uh, who else is around? There's a Pidgeotto. Uh, I want to see... Oh, Sadek's gone now. There's Corsola here. Corsola. You can't cross this bridge. Are you sure? Because I just did during that chase mini game. I want to give someone a quiz, and that's why I'm blocking the way. Don't worry, I'll let you through if you answer the questions correctly. Sure, I can do a quiz. What do you receive when you win a skill game? Berries? What does your tail look like? A lightning bolt? What do these Pokemon has claws? For alligator? I did a thing. Uh, there's Floatzel. It's going all over the place. Lately, I've seen some fights and conflicts around Monkey Park, but I think that friendship can never be truly lost forever. Mmm. It can always return. The Monkey Park will become united again. I truly believe that. You do you, Floatzel. Well, I have increased range on my Thunderbolt now. Oh, he can just run into my Thunderbolt. Riveting gameplay. This would be so cool if it had like an HD remaster, not even remaster, just everything from uh, Gen 1 to Gen 7 as like an HD version of Poké Park. I'd actually like that. You're not bad at all. I think Weasel can learn from you. Can we be friends? Call me when you need me in attractions. Yeah, not counting uh, Gen 8, because at the time of recording this, Gen 8 uh, is not out. There's a Vaporeon over here. That is a terrible voice. It's like... I can't even do that voice. Did you come here to see the ocean? Isn't it lovely? You want to play a skill game? Let's see. I'll play Chase. Once you've made 30 friends, because all the evolutions are stubborn jerks who just want to play the Facebook game. You can't do this unless you have X amount of friends. Uh, does not look like there's anything on this side of here. Let's explore re the rest of this area. Oh, wait, Wingle, can you sit down? Wingle. Wingle, sit down. Wingle! Wingle, the iceberg zone is across the ocean. Those cannot fly or swim can ask Lapras to take you there. You want to play Chase? Uh, 
Well, eventually he needs to sit down, so that's when I'll strike. Get down here. Bop. You win. Will you be my friend? Yeah, you know, every Wingle is my buddy. Uh, wait, Talo? Talo and Staravia, hello. Oh, the attraction is above the cliff. It's only for Pokemon who can fly. Me? I play it all the time, of course. Get back here, stupid bird. Stupid bird, come back here. Stupid bird. Stupid bird. Swap. The squeaky noises of the footsteps in this game are amazing. Cool, I can use Taylor and attractions. Uh, I don't know where Star Bravia went. I'll run into them again eventually. There's a Sharpedo. A Sharpedo and a Carvana in the water. Uh, let's do Psyduck's thingy. Psyduck. Ah, oh, I had a nightmare where a big rock fell from the sky. It hit the poke. It hit the poke park, making it sink to the bottom of the sea. I want to play hide and seek and forget the, all about that dream. Let's play. How about a game of hide and seek? We are kind of like round. I don't know where Psyduck would necessarily hide. Oh, that's where Psyduck would hide. Like, okay. I love playing with you, let's be friends. By the way, I had a dream of Golda was swimming toward the beach zone. I wonder if we'll come and play here. Coming to go surfing. Uh, but, 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 there's Staravia. More wood. Uh, Spiro. We have Spiro, right? From the attraction from before. Yeah, we have we have Spiro. Uh, I can battle this one. We didn't battle the other one. Dive bomb into my thunderbolt like a good little bird. Spiro is now dead. Mudkip. Mudkip, wait. Mudkip. Mudkip. I came here because it sounded like fun. I love skill games. Oh, yes, I heard a tip from Wingle on Carlover's attraction. It's an attraction where you have to fly, so I can't play it. We start the attraction and look for circles in the distance. You get a line on them, and you can fly hide and seek. Hide and seek. Where could Mudkip have gone? Where could Mudkip have gone? I could never find a single Mudkip in this entire beach. It's too large. Oof. You found me. Too obvious? Can we play again? Well, now with talking to Mudkip, I think I'm gonna call this episode here. We still have a little bit more of the beach to explore, and a bunch more Pokemon to talk to, so we'll do that next time. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. He squeaked.